Uh, Jets taking on the Steelers. Steelers favored by three and a half over under 41 and a half in this game. What are your thoughts? I'm taking the Steelers here. Um, you know, Zach Wilson's first game back since the preseason. Not quite sure what this offense is going to keep from Joe Flacco or if it's going to transform a little bit under Zach Wilson. Um, you can see you could see the running game be present a little bit more, but uh, I'm going to take the Steelers and I think I'm going to take the under here. I've also got the under and I've also got the Steelers here as well, right? Like I'm, I'm not necessarily sold at the quarterback change over here, and I'm very interested to see how this one's going to come to play. Um, you look at it, the, one of the things that, that benefits uh, the Jets right now is the fact that TJ Watts out. Uh, Zach Wilson tends to hang onto the ball a little bit more so than Joe Flacco does. Uh, tries to extend plays, get out the pocket, uh, drive the ball down the field a little bit versus Flacco doing some of the check down. So it does concern me a little bit about some of these running backs on what we've seen. I am excited for some of the wide receivers on this one. I'm really curious to see what the connection looks like between Garrett Wilson, and Zach Wilson. And I'm very interested to see what Elijah Moore uh, you know, looks like having Zach Wilson uh, back behind center as well. Uh, prop that I really liked on this one. And it's just because the ceiling was so low on this one. Zach Wilson over 205 and a half passing yards. I think that that one is one that he can he can hit manage on this one. I don't see that the there's a way that the Jets are going to be able to run the ball enough to keep them in the game on this one. And you're going to still have to see some passing attempts on this. No, oh, fair enough. I'm taking Najee over 66 and a half rushing yards. I think. Um, the Jets' defensive line has been just leaky enough that it helps kind of a struggling Pittsburgh offensive line. Um, so I think they do enough to open things up for Najee. He got in the end zone last week, um, starting to get the ball rolling here, get the usage back up here. So I, uh, I'm taking Najee to hit the over on his rushing prop. Uh, 